Hi everybody, welcome to Lovely TV. Our guest today is my good friend Lauren DiNapoli. She is an, she is an IFBB figure pro. She is also a full-time physical therapist. She owns her own online business called Fueled Bodies. So if you're looking for something, you wanna to go to fueledbodies.com for sure. And she's a wife. And also, what happened five months ago, Lauren? I had twins. Seriously, people, she had twins. Can you believe it? <laughs> it's amazing to me. I have a few questions here from our viewers. Okay, you ready for them? I am. All right, perfect. One, describe your day. Oh boy, you ready? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm ready. Um, well, I usually get woken up by, by my son or my daughter, or both, uh, around 5 a.m. That's when my day starts. And um, I always implement exercise into my day. Um, I have my food planned, so I'm ready to go right when my feet hit the ground. Um, I work full time, so I am actually in the clinic treating patients. Then I come home and I answer emails, and then I take care of my kids for the evening, and it's just craziness. <laughs> I would say that's craziness. Wouldn't you guys say that's craziness? That's craziness. With your busy day, how do you fit your exercise in? I make it a priority. Um, I have got to plan the day before the time that I'm actually going to be working out. And if it's a day that I'm home with my babies all day long, mm -hmm. I can't take them out with me to go work out, I will work out at home. So are there some things you can share with our viewers, some things that they can do at home, some types of workouts? You can get a really, really great cardiovascular and strength workout right in your living room. And I have done that many times. I believe you, because I've seen it, all right, firsthand. So describe to someone who has no idea what a really good cardiovascular strength moves would be that they can do right there in their house. Well, I think the biggest tip is to um, do exercises in succession of each other. So it can be squats, lunges, push-ups, jumping jacks, um, something we call burpees. All done in succession of each other right. will really get your heart rate up and just be amazing. Um, my suggestion is write it all down on a piece of paper and have it in a place where you can see it and just go through those exercises one after the other until you actually need a break. You know, that's a really good idea because that does get your heart rate up. Absolutely. Okay, perfect. You guys get that? So getting both in at the same time, not a bad tip. Thank you for that. So question for you, because I know you love exercise and you, you make sure you get it in every day or as many days as you can. How do you feel the days that you don't get your, your workouts in compared to the ones that you do? And there has been many of those days too. And I think in the beginning, right after I had my twins, of course, I couldn't exercise um, right away. Right. But I did make it a point to at least stretch and um, do some really gentle movements. On the days that I don't exercise, I feel stiffer. Okay. I feel more tired. Um, it is a little bit more difficult to even stay awake during the day, really? surprisingly. Um, I will actually just get more energy with my workouts yep. and it's just, I'm a happier person. I can deal with my kids better. When they're upset, I don't get as overwhelmed. Um, so it really, if from a mental and physical standpoint, I just feel like a, a much better person. One last question. Do you have any other tips or tricks or anything else that you can share with our viewers on how they can um, really implement having this kind of exercise, exercise in their lives on a daily basis? My, my suggestion is you, you must have a goal. You okay. must have a why. Why is exercise going to be important to you on a regular basis? If you don't have that why, it's really hard to motivate yourself when you have so many different things going on. Um, so have your goal, have your why, and then plan. The night before, make your intentions known. Right. Tell your spouse, um, get childcare, whatever it is that you need to do to get your workout in, it's going to be so much ben more beneficial to do that. You have got to plan. Perfect. Well, thank you. You're welcome. You know, thank you for coming onto the show. And I just want to thank our viewers. Hopefully these tips were helpful for you. So stay tuned because there's going to be many, many more guests coming on and sharing what they do within their lives to make sure it's healthier. Have a great day, everybody.